Hey friends, I'm here with a Timu haul. I went on Timu to look for some bag charms, some affordable jewelry. So look at this cute little, it's like a little change purse. I think I put change purse into the search bar for this, but um, it also has this. So you can clip it to your bag, but how cute is this? And it was $2.39. So it looks like a little Pac-Man ghost and I am super here for that. But for $2.39, um, I think it was a good deal. And it has like a little, a little pocket in here. So this could easily hold your hand, um, hand cream, your lip gloss, even your key maybe, key fob. But yeah, I'm really happy with this. It's really good quality. I mean, I'm really excited to use this. I like this. This came out really good. And for $2.39, I believe they had this in other colors. So I might go in there and pick another one up because this is so cute. And it, since it does have the, the hook and the keychain, I can connect it to my tote bag. Because I actually have the Coach Pac-Man tote when they released that collection years ago. I have a lot of novelty coach purses. I'm gonna have to do a haul video on that, but yeah, this is gonna look super cute on that. So while we're talking about bag charms, I did find this. Now this is, this is supposed to be similar to the um, Mui Mui, and I hope I'm saying that right, cause I don't know, I don't have one. Um, bag charm and it's like I don't know 200 bucks or something something's ridiculousness going on for this and all this is is paracording and I was going to try and make my own because I back in the day when um, people were making paracord bracelets I have paracording from back then this was I don't have the price on this I want to say it was like two dollars but I think this will be so cute I have my, one of my little bags with me and I thought, look, look how cute that would be just hanging from there. So I might try and um, like figure out a way to, I think you gotta like wrap it around or something like like this or something, something that I fact. So this is another one that I hauled from my previous Timu haul for my bag charms when I DIY'd them. And this actually is a connector for the coach bags that you can get. It's a replica or a dupe of that. And you can extend it, your your strap. So this looks similar to the hardware on the coach bag. And this is a coach bag. So it does look pretty much exactly like it. Um, but what you could do is if you want it to use this to hook it onto here, you could hook it this way and just kind of hook it like that. Because I don't, this bag doesn't have, um, I, it does have a crossbody, but I'm not, I don't have it on. But you could hang it down here. So I thought that would be really cute. You could hang on the side and put your little thing right here. I think it would be cute. So anyway, that was um, $2, I believe. But I will have the prices in the description below. Now, on to the jewelry. Um, so here's a couple of things that I bought. So I have been seeing these rings all over my timeline. All the girlies have them. And look how cute that is. And these were, I want to say, somewhere between two and five. But I will have the price and the link to these in the description below. But I want to say, I didn't write the price on these. But I think they were between two and five dollars a piece. And then I got the gold one with, it looks like a yellow face. So here are the ones that I got. Um, it looks like I purchased two of the same one. This is what happens when you shop and you are half asleep. You end up buying more than one. I thought though I bought one with a black face, but I'm not for sure. So, but they are um, like the watch band. So they're kind of adjustable and fit on different fingers. This one has like a greenish color face in it. It um, is a little bit different than these. So I thought this was gold. So I can definitely tell you that I like this one much better. Um, I do like, I do like this one, but I think this one is probably my favorite. So if I had to choose one, it'd probably be this one. So I, I do believe they were all under five dollars, 
they were very inexpensive and with Timu when you're on there sometimes they have this like spinning thing and you get coupons so I think that's why I got so many of these or I just clicked on too many you get to pick a free gift when you spin so I'm gonna move on now I'm gonna start with the silver jewelry so this is a ring that I got it's really pretty I really like the silver one and I have very small little hands but this was a size 7 and this ring was $1.65 and then I got this ring as well, but it's a stackable ring. So you actually got two rings for a dollar twenty. You got both of these. And basically the picture showed him like this, like stacking. And again, I got them bigger because I wanted them to go on different fingers. So that is what that was. Um, then I also got some bracelets. Um, I have a lot of gold bracelets, but not a lot of silver. So I got this one, and this one was $2.34. And it kind of reminds me of like the Gucci bamboo uh, handle. And it goes like that. Okay, so I took my bracelets off. So it does go like that. I have very small wrists, so this would be would definitely fit on a larger wrist. Um, I think it might, you might be able to like mold it a little bit, but I am going to try it without my rings on. Um, I will show you how small my wrists are. So this is a seven inch or even six and a half inch bracelet and it it's that much bigger on my on my hand so for reference but yeah this would fit I would think most people would fit and this was again two dollars and 34 cents and I think it it's really pretty actually I, I think it's really good so then I went for a different one so I went for this link bracelet I love toggle bracelets because they're just so much easier to put on than a regular clasp of course I won't be able to get this on now because I said that but so this one um, I will tell you if this is tight on me it probably would be very small for most people and this is supposed to it showed it on a man so this was two dollars and thirty four cents so I think in my opinion this is very small even for me so I don't believe it would fit most people. So then I got this one. It's kind of an over-exaggerated ball chain kind of kind of bracelet. And it was $1.39. So this is kind of different. Um, I don't know if this is really my style. <laughs> but it is very um, different. And for someone whose style it is, I think it would be good. I mean, for a dollar... $1.39 I think I wrote or $1.59 this would be a cute and it would probably be cute with the right outfit I just I don't know but it does slip in and out of my hand pretty easy and it looks like I'm not sure if this actually comes off I would assume it does um so you'd be able to put it on that way but yeah my hand slips through it almost like it's a bangle so that is kind of what that looks like then um, I bought another one. Again, I was probably too asleep and just picking stuff. This is a smaller version of that one. That's this one. And this one was $1.22. I think this would be more, I think I would wear this more than that one. And this one you can put on like you would a regular chain. Um, it just pops right on and off. And I definitely think I, I can see myself wearing this one. This one is not as bulky on me and I really like it. I bought, the reason I looked even at these is I have a gold necklace like this. Um, and it really is cute. So I really like it. I thought it would be cute. So there's that one. And again, that was $1.22. And then I bought this to go with it. And this is the necklace that goes with that bracelet. And this was $2.62. So what I think is nice about this is it's just plain. So if you want it to, you know, all of us have 8,000 charms in our craft room. You could add a pendant to that or maybe like a, you know, like a bead of some sort, an AB 
kind of color bead would be pretty or any any kind of bead so um i might do that since some of you ladies know how to wire wrap i am trying i'm not the best at it but i might be able to make something that would hang off of that as a pendant or you could even make like a little charm necklace because it's got these little spaces and you could put multiple ones so yeah for two dollars 62 cents i do like that with the matching bracelet so for about five bucks a little under five dollars you got a set that's not bad and then i did find this one and this has this big puffy heart hanging from it and this is obviously a shorter necklace and this necklace was one dollar 98 cents and i thought this would be really kind of different if you're trying to go for a more chunkier look and want to add if you because i don't have any chunky necklaces that are silver they're all very thin and I thought this would be a nice way to layer them up. So again, $1, $1.98, so for two bucks. So that is the necklaces. And then this is a ring that I got and I tried to open it up before I started this video. So this is how the ring came. And it came in this, which I thought was pretty cool. I've never had anything come in one of these. But it's like, so it doesn't get damaged. So that was nice. And this was $2.36. This is another ring. It looks like this one's adjustable. Let me just double check. This one, it is. It's adjustable. And it's a little safety pin. I don't know if you can see. And I thought this would be cute. Um, again, you could stack start stacking them you could put them like that or you could even put that in the middle have a nice little stack ring stack so yeah so that is the silver part of the haul so I'm gonna move on to the gold I didn't get much gold because I have a lot already all right so I'll start with this one this is a ring and it has three pieces to it so it kind of looks like it's stacked already, but it has this connector, so it's kind of stacked for you. And this one was probably the most expensive thing I got, which was $5.97. And it's this. So I think it looks nice. Um, I believe I got this in a size 7. So it can fit here. It did come in larger sizes. I just have small narrow fingers so that was that one um i'll keep that one on put this one to the side then i bought a couple of um bracelets here's one for four dollars 94 cents so this gold bracelet i do not know how this goes on okay so that took a lot for me to get this out but i ended up just going in here and turning it in order to do it because I was trying to hold it on this end and there was nothing to grasp onto so I'm going to put it on this side because I am right-handed and then you screw it on now I'm not going to screw it on because I had trouble getting it off but it is pretty though and I think it would be once I kind of loosen it up a little bit and put it on and off then I think it will be easier to get on and off but basically this is what I did was grab this inner part and then this comes out so I think it's pretty it looks really good quality it's pretty heavy um, and I think that's a good deal for four dollars and ninety four cents so that was that one and then I got another one similar to the silver this was just a, a gold bangle oh no disregard it actually opens and closes which is nice I love these kind of bangles that just snap closed so yeah so that looks nice um, I'm not going to close it all the way because I need to make sure I can get it off. I need to put it on this hand because I can't get it off with my left. But it does look nice and this was probably the least expensive of the gold. It was $1.98. Um, it's like a full bangle versus the silver that is like a, like a half bangle I guess you'd call it. But yeah, so it does just snap together. And then I bought this for $2.79. And it's like a little, I guess, lapel pin, I guess you'd call it. I probably said that wrong. But um, I thought 
this could be cute for a couple of things one it could be cute right on your coat especially since here in michigan we are definitely about to hit big huge coat season and i thought this would be really cute on the side this would be cute on a sweater this would be cute on shoes the girlies are putting all kinds of cute charms on their sambas and they are looking super cute well all the shoes not just sambas but i thought um i have a pair of black boots like combat boots and this might even look cute on it on there so i thought this could have multiple uses and again this was two dollars and 79 cents now be aware that with timu and the different sellers they could be different prices because you can get the same item at different stores so search around if you think it's too much search um for something else for another seller on there and they might have the exact same thing because i actually did buy another one um by accident i did buy another one because again shopping when you're sleeping and this one came broken um you can see all the little beads and stuff falling out the the wire the string broke so i am going to return this well you just put in for a return that's the other nice thing i like about timu is that and this is not sponsored by the way but but if you want to return something you just go in and return it and they usually give you an option to take a little bit less than what you paid for it and you don't have to return it like you don't have to take it back to the post office they say just keep it and you get i want to it's somewhere like around 80 percent of what you paid but for me um even if i don't use it then at least i don't have to deal with getting it wrapped back up and taking it up to the post office and all that other kind of stuff but this um is broken and i could use these beads um, these little pearls and stuff for something else at Crafty and I could use the safety pins so I could use all of this um, even though it's broken and I'm sure plenty of you ladies could too and I just realized I forgot one last thing I did get this I forgot to put this in with the silver stuff this is another bracelet and it's still for right now I mean it's still spooky season I know that half of us are already on Christmas but it is still spooky season but look at this little cough how stinking cute is that and this was two dollars and 15 cents again my my arm is just so small and this i feel like is is a novelty item but i don't think it's as good as quality as like some of the other silver pieces that i got especially not this i mean you can tell the difference between those two for sure but i think i am definitely going to go back and get the full bangle of this of this one because I really like this in the silver I think it came out really nice but this is cute like I still we still have Halloween next week and our trick-or-treaters come on Halloween so maybe I'll wear this with my outfit but yeah so I just thought I'd show that to you and again this was two dollars and fifteen cents but I just wanted to share that haul with you all and I am going to be starting to get more things from Timo because I want to add to my closet and maybe try the trends but I may not want to spend a whole lot of money until I actually know I like the trends. So for me, this is an affordable option to get this. And again, th this is like two or three orders. So I didn't order everything at the same time. But again, check for the Timu um, coupons. This little spin thing pops up that's annoying as all get out when you get on the app. But a lot of times it will give you a free item or 90% off an item in your cart. So... I would suggest what I've been doing is adding to my cart and then backing out of the app and then come back in at another time when you want to purchase something and it'll say hey if you purchase right now what's in your cart here's another coupon for one of the items to be a hundred percent off or one of the items will be 90 percent off and so that way you're paying even less than what the price is that's that's advertised so that's just a little life hack i will put the links of the stuff that i can still have from my order so thanks so much for being with me today and enjoying the video and i will talk to you soon